This is Johnny with Rudomatic here at the Colin Cross Colin Ranch uh, Association office. Um, taking a look at the sewer line. We've got the line. We, I got the camera out actually about 137 feet. I had to stop for a minute there um, and reset at 30 feet. So and then I went out another 100 and 107. So anyways, we got water flowing. I wanted to see what the operating level of this line was. This is going to be kind of a longer video, but uh, I think it's important to uh, get to the bottom of what's going on here. So... so we're coming back. This is a larger line, I think it's six inch, it could be eight inch. They're at the uh, about 20 feet back from the main where this area is, which you know, we have uh, some standing water. You can see that it's not. It's not clogging line, it's just a, a long, flat line, and I think that's going to be kind of the way things go on the whole line. So, let's see here, you know, if there's, if there's some standing water, you know, two inches of standing water in a four inch pipe is kind of a is a problem but two inches of standing water in a six or eight inch pipe it really is not much of a problem um, and i can tell that this line just doesn't have a lot of slope going across so not seeing any big offset or root intrusion anything like that they would merit some sort of replacement and so that's why I'm kind of pumping the brakes on that whole uh, idea right now I'm just thinking that with with some maintenance, running a snake every once in a while, every couple years or something, might be able to get this line to work well. I know that Darren was out here the other day and ran the snake a ton for three hours, so that might have taken care of the problems that they were dealing with <clears throat> for the most part. And if we just keep up on that maintenance, it might might be okay. You can tell that we're underwater now, probably two to three inches of water. We'll pop out of that in a second here. You can see that water level now, we're up above it. provide good information so that there's a, you know, a competent decision being made with all this. Now we're coming up towards the clean out and then we're here in the clean out. So. Clean out parking lot. Any questions, we'll go over them.